I'm massively positive. I'm, I've got boundless energy. I'm a very curious person, uh, but I, I do have the concentration span of an ant. It's good because I'm blessed with masses of ideas on a daily basis, and then the challenge is always you know, making those ideas a reality. When I got asked to actually do a course with Defender, I was, I was delighted because I've, I've been driving one for many years and uh, I love the sort of simplicity of them and the, the fact they're so utilitarian. The Defender was engineered and not designed because that just shows you that it was very much about function rather than form. So I love the practicality of it uh, and, and that's, that sort of function is what I desire uh, more and more around the world. Actually, my dream was to be a professional racing cyclist, which actually in hindsight, I definitely wouldn't have been good enough. But anyway, it ended with a, a bad crash. The great thing was that I, I made some friends in hospital and they said, oh, let's meet in this pub. And by chance, it was the pub where all the uh, young people from the art school went. Suddenly all these words that I'd never heard of were suddenly in the conversation, like the Bauhaus or Wozzley Kandinsky or pop art and all these amazing things that intrigued me. And, uh, Suddenly I discovered the world of creativity and um, ended up working in a clothes shop. All I really wanted to do was just be in fashion and be in a creative world and, and enjoy uh, just earning a living. The rest, as they say, is history. There was never this strong determination with me about having a business around the world. I was just happy, just doing what I was doing. It's hard to define style because somebody could be dressed in a, in a very casual way and, and still look really stylish. It's not about being smart or casual. It's, it's just slowly working it out what suits you. What I've always promoted is individuality, uh, having a strong spirit, doing things differently. So you can be as classic, as serious as you want or you can be as playful as you want. And that's what I wanted to do with the Defender is a respect the wonderful uh, vehicle it is, but give it a, a, a sense of fun, and, but really thinking it through for its function and its history. Actually think about what the Defender is famous for, and it's famous for the use on farms, uh, use in the armed forces, and uh, what I've realised with mine is that if you bash a corner, you can easily replace a bit. I thought it would be very amusing to do them in different colours, almost like you've replaced bits over the years and the, the colour they had in the in the in the yard was burgundy or the colour they had in the yard was grey uh, but then you'll see very fluorescent colours on the car as well and that's with the reference to the fact they're often used as emergency vehicles it, hopefully the car reflects the honest history of the Defender it's been brilliant working on the Defender and it was so such a joy to be asked privileged to have a Paul Smith defender at the end of this fantastic era.